want to get cross -faced. So you're in this good moral position already. It's just a matter of reaching over again, catching that arm from half guard here. So maybe I'm, I got on the shoulder and the wrist. She's trying to get the cross face. We're going to wrist around. Same thing, sitting up, kicking over. This time I don't have that leg over her hip. Right now it's very important to keep this elbow away from her body. So if I, she gets in here, she can be held, trying to pull this out. So as soon as I catch this, I want to keep it away from her body. Same thing, I got to roll to my back. So they, all of these tamores from the bottom, I need to be flat on my back. If she can keep me up on my side, it's going to be very hard for me to finish this gamora. So I want to roll flat to my back. Again, pitching that elbow in tight, looking to raise it up. So we're here, Megan's going for the cross face, blocking it. Shrimp out a little bit maybe. I, I gotta have a little bit of space where I can kind of crunch up and get over top of that arm. So as I shoot that arm through and get it, I wanna keep her wrist away from her body as much as I can. Rolling back, pinching it tight, take it up towards the ceiling. Don't let go of your half guard. That's her way out. Yep. She can start walking all the way around and if I hold on to it like a fool, go right into her arm bar or to more herself. Here, defending the cross face. Keep that wrist away. Roll it over. Keep it pinched tight. Two more from half guard. Any questions? All right, let's do it. 